Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. And today we're going to learn about solving multi step equations, and we're going to solve each equation. So, if I was given this equation 12 times 2k plus 11 is equal to 12 times 2k plus 12. So, what I want to do is I'm going to simplify on each side of the equal sign. I'm going to distribute the 12. Cross first. So 12 times 2k, which is a 24k, plus 12 times 11, which I saved here, which is 132. That's equal to 12 times 2k, which is a 24k. Let's go distribute this again. 12 again. And 12 times 12 is a 144. Okay. So now let's simplify. Let's bring our numbers to the left, our variables to the left, and our numbers to the right. So we'll subtract the 24k to both sides here. And I'm going to subtract our 132 to both sides. I'm left now with 24k minus 24k, and 132 minus 132. This is 0, right? So there's a 0 on the left-hand side. On the right-hand side, 24k minus 24k eliminates, which is 0. But 144 minus 132 is a uh, 12. All right, we have a positive 12 here. So now we have a 0 equals a 12. So what happens there? Well, does 0 equal 12? No, 0 does not equal 12. That is false. Since we came to something where a number equaled another number, and it wasn't true, it wasn't equal, this is no solution. Meaning that there is no solution, no number that we can plug in for k that makes this equation true. So again, our final answer here is just no solution. So let's recap. We're given 12 times 2k plus 11 equals 12 times 2k plus 12. I distributed to both parentheses, right, the 12 to the first one and this 12 to the second parenthesis there. Give me 24k plus 132 equals 24k plus 144. Brought my variables to the left, my numbers to the right, and that ended up um, giving me a 0 equals a 12. That's not true, right? 0 cannot equal 12. Can't equal 2. So when that happens, if we have something that's not equal to another one, right, something that's not a true statement, our final answer is just no solution.